Alright, uh, this is going to be uh, intermediate cancelling. Best time to cancel uh, is off stun and, uh, and when they're in the corner. Some basic things is uh, the fireball. And this, you don't do anything, it's just. Sorry, missed that one, but you get the idea. You actually can, if you actually um, have unlimited, you can just keep doing this. And that's how I practice it. You can keep doing it. If you're doing it right, it'll keep comboing. I should keep it on the dance floor one second. Ah, sorry. Sorry, but you can keep going. You can just keep going with it. And uh, that's really good because it, it helps you with the timing and uh, the canceling. So, I mean, you can just... That just you can just keep doing it and doing it and and yeah and that's a good way to practice. The, um, another intermediate thing is doing the mid punch. It's the same thing as the mid uh, mid kick. See what I'm saying? Just keep going with it. You'll get used to it. I mean, you really don't need to do it that many times. But the point is. Like I said, you want your neural memory, you want it to be um, just ingrown into your system that you don't even have to think about twice about it, you just, just keep going. And um, that's a good way to practice it, those are pretty intermediate cancels, and uh, those stem, really when the guy's in the corner, it's really good because you can go, I mean ultra, that's free. What is that black line? I don't know what that is. Like I said, I think I asked before, but somebody needs to tell me what that is so I can fix it, it's really annoying. I'm not going to do any ultras because of that stupid black line, but you get the idea. And then from there you can go ultra if you have a full bar. Um, but yeah, I mean, most of the time if you can cancel with Ryu, if you have the opportunity, like if this hits, go for the damage because it's it's big damage. I mean, this, that's I think is, I think at least a super or something or something ridiculous. It's, it's close to a super in most people's ultras, so you go... And the fierce is important, so that's another thing to practice. Pretty intermediate stuff, or you can just go. That's good too. The match is gonna be over. But yeah, just keep practicing that. And um, another thing, if he's too far for the for the fierce, you can go with the mid. Sorry, it's also good. I mean, the thing is, like with uh, with with. When you're in the corner, go for the fierce because they're not going anywhere. But if you're in open, if you're in open like open ground, like open level, you go. You just gotta be a little closer. But you see what I mean? Because it, if, when you're in the corner, he doesn't get knocked back, so you're able to do more to him. But when he's out in the open, he's gonna get knocked back from the mid, so you're actually forced to do that. But that's also another intermediate thing. Just keep doing it, and that's it. Really, I mean, you just keep. Go closer with the mid, and you just keep going, guys. Sorry, getting ahead of myself. And yeah, see, if you're gonna do it, you can do mid punch to mid kick, but you can't go mid kick to mid punch most of the time, unless you're really, really deep. But I wouldn't recommend it. So I would, if you're gonna do this, just finish with the mid kick because it's guaranteed to hit. If you're gonna use mid kick, follow with mid kick. And um, another thing, uh, not really advanced, but it's helpful. I mean, it does damage. Every time, like I said, every time Ryu hits you, because he's such a powerful character, he just hits hard. And that's why I've always liked him, because he was simple and he hit hard. I don't know, I guess I was a dumb kid or something when I was growing up. But if you're just, if you do this, I mean, that's a combo. And look how much health that took. I mean, that's huge. I mean, it's free damage for two bars that you're, and most of the time if you have two bars, I mean, that means you, usually means you're hitting them, and I mean, a sweep can be the difference between um, winning and losing, and that's the thing, like, missing combos is horrible, and that's why at such high-level play, they barely miss it, and if they do miss it, most of the time, I would say about at least 75% of the time, it'll be the reason why they lose. So, combos are a pretty big deal. And yeah, I think that's going to be it for intermediate canceling for now. Keep practicing, guys. Like I said, the biggest thing, the biggest thing I can say for you to do is get this guy in the corner and go. Oh, 
uh, 22 hits. And of course, that's impossible. But, you know, just keep doing that. And if you keep doing it, it's going to become a lot easier over time. All right, I'm going to go into advanced, and I think that's going to wrap it up.